today about one half of the energy consumed in the world goes to electric motors. Our, our mission is to design and build motors that are better for people and better for, for the planet. All the components in our machine are designed to be reused or recycled. Typically, it begins with a, a problem statement. Uh, and design engineering is a little bit different than, than R&D. I'm not really starting with a pencil sketch. I'm, I'm starting with a problem. So from that point, then I kind of think about, well, how would I, how would I model that? Uh, and in the world of simulation, you want to model it as efficiently as possible. So I pretty much uh, use ANSYS every day and uh, modeled all of the subsystems within the motor. Uh, the internal impeller, I've modeled the external impeller, I've looked at the heat transfer inside of the uh, VFD, and ANSYS is, is a big part of all of that. As a startup and, uh, and a, I would say a creative company, we keep pushing the envelope every year hundreds of millions of motors go into the market. So you can imagine, if you can improve the efficiency of these motors by a few percentage points, it's gonna have a tremendous impact. Our motors compared to traditional induction motors, which is the vast majority of the motors out there, they are about 10% more efficient. We want to eventually make des design decisions uh, based on the results. Uh, and you don't really want to waste time on something that, that doesn't work. So, so basically, in order to lead the way, I, I need that confidence, I need that accuracy in order to do that. Simulation becomes a very important tool for us because we can actually explore how new designs operate even before building them. ANSYS has the most comprehensive uh, simulation suite available in the market today. Really, uh, if it weren't for ANSYS, then I would be test. And testing, uh, you know, you, it'd be an iterative process of test, look at the results, build something new, and then test it again. So when you start adding up all these factors, we can see clearly that this has a, a, a immediate impact and is going to have a very big impact in the future as well.